a familiar melody bringing back memories for Don Carey. You know, I remember it to this day like it happened yesterday. I close my eyes to go to bed and that's what I see. I see two Marines standing on my doorstep. There to tell them their son, 23-year-old Marine Corps Corporal Barton Hummelhaus, was killed in Iraq. It's a feeling you wouldn't wish on your worst enemy. It's, it's not like anything we've ever experienced. The main thing we try to focus on is that we try to conduct our lives in living in his memory. That's why the Careys have joined other families who have lost loved ones in the run for the fallen. Thousands ran in this year's event, taking each step in memory of those who paid the ultimate price. More than 350 white crosses placed here at the park with the names and pictures of the heroes who have fallen. Heroes like Army Specialist David Hess, who died in Afghanistan in 2010 when his son Briar was just four years old. I know he loved me. And to show their love, runners were all assigned to one of the fallen heroes, wearing their names and pictures proudly while they ran. This is the treasure that you take with you and you keep them. Keeping their memories alive so families like the Careys know their sons and daughters will never be forgotten. In Hillsborough County, Sarah Bell Soul, Bay News 9.